good morning so we are headed to new orleans for the weekend and i'm super excited i'm excited to eat some good food have some good drinks here is my airport look just this black sheer top beige shorts a black ribbed bodysuit of course my Tory Burch sandals these are one of three shoes and my other shoes are my white pair of Tory Burch um dad sandals and some heels but yeah and then I'm carrying my YSL bag don't feel like dealing with my tote bag because I want to carry less amount of things so yeah but this is our look we headed to the airport we out Sephora to waste time because we can't check into our room until four. <laughs> it's a cute beach bag. I don't feel like trying on nothing, but I got the hubby trying on stuff. I'm not in the mood. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so I am getting ready to do my makeup because we're going to um, Morrow's or Morrow. I don't know if it has an S on it. I'm not sure, but we're going there for dinner tonight. Let me zoom, y'all. Back a little. Okay, that's better. Um, so, yeah, we're going there for dinner tonight, y'all. The lighting in this bathroom is not good. What's crazy is we stayed at this hotel in 2020, and I don't remember the bathroom lighting being this bad. <laughs> Um, but it's bad and I don't see any other, yeah, it's no other lights I can turn on. So I do apologize. I feel like my makeup is probably going to look really, um, interesting because the lighting is so funny, but that's okay. We will push through. I'm about to, I've already did my brows. As you can see, I put on my first primer, which is the Fenty, um, soft matte. And I'm now putting on the milk hydro grip. I usually don't travel with this, but y'all, like, cause this is not really travel size. But y'all, it's New Orleans and it's hot, baby. It is hot. So I don't want my makeup just straight coming off. Um, I'm sure it's not going to be as hot by the time we leave out. But when we were walking around earlier today, baby, it's hot. So we got here. Um, our room was not going to be ready until closer to check-in time. So we went across the street because we're at the Lowe's. It's literally directly across the street from the Caesars um casino um i ain't used this primer in a while y'all i forgot how sticky this be but um 
yeah, so we walked over there, and then we went to the river walk. We went around into the stores, got some food, um, got a drink from, well, we got some shots, and then we got some drink, a drink from Fat Tuesdays, and then we had some beignets. Um, and then after we left there, we went back to the casino and had drinks at the bar that time. And then um, after that, we, um, what else? After that, we um, walked over to H&M in Sephora. In Sephora, I got some stuff. It's not in here with me right now, but I will pull it out and show y'all um, at some point or another. Um, and then my husband got, this is a lot, I don't grab a little too much. Um, my husband grabbed some stuff out of H&M. I'm just going in with the Manwa color, kind of supposed to be like on the out side and then I take the Marquise's shade kind of more so in the center of my face um I don't want a ton on because like I said it's just hot um but yeah and then yes yeah, so I got some stuff in Sephora my husband got like some shorts and a top um from H&M so that was cool and then by the time we did all that it was time for us to get in our room so we came in here, got situated, put our stuff up, and then um, I ironed our clothes and stuff to get us ready for this evening. Took a shower and now, and relaxed for like, mm, like 30, 40 minutes. Took a shower, um, relaxed, and then um, now here we are getting ready. Thank you, do all that. So now we are getting ready. Um, I debated if I even wanted to wear makeup this trip, y'all, because it is literally just so hot. Like, I sweat in my face. So, for all the girls that don't, lucky you, but I sweat in my face. That doesn't mean my makeup is just going to come off, but if I try to dab my face or any of that, it's, it's over with. Um, but I have, I know, less than an hour to get ready because, like I said, I was relaxing our reservations at 7 30 i know it's probably like 6 20 now but i'm not doing anything crazy so it should be easy y'all this lighting in the bathroom like <laughs> i don't put my foundation on it don't even look like it on camera there is like a side mirror here that's a little bit better but thankfully i brought like all my usual stuff so, I kind of, you know when it's like your normal makeup products, you know what you're going to get. So, even if lighting is poor, like, it's your normal stuff. I'm only going to go in with one layer of concealer today. Like I said, it's not that serious. Um, this is just my Too Faced Makeful, my go-to. Um, but so far, we are having a good time, y'all. Um, when we came to New Orleans the last time, it was during the pandemic. It was September 2020. It was my birthday. And while we overall had a good time, had some good food and all that stuff, we didn't get to really enjoy it the same way just because it was a lot of stuff closed up. You know, not many people were out. Bourbon Street was like boarded up. <laughs> so we didn't get to experience it the same way. So I wanted my husband to get the full experience. I've been to New Orleans two other times before that. For Mardi Gras, yeah. So two other times before that I've been here, but my husband hadn't been. And I wanted to make sure, you know, he got to experience, you know, New Orleans at his best. So that is why we sent us out order. So that's why we decided to take a little weekend trip. I honestly wanted to spend my whole summer doing little small weekend getaways um i like short trips like i know some people like to be gone from home for a while but me personally i prefer short getaways um meaning for me typically it's a three night excuse me three day two night type trip like that's my favorite um type of trip i get to do you know the things i want to do see some you know stuff and explore but then i also get to just relax and just you know have a good time so for this particular trip um we just wanted to you know just have a get getaway you know like it doesn't have to be 
anything crazy. You don't have to spend a ton of money, but just get away from home and get a break from regular, regular life. And then in two days, you go back home. So I like that. Um, that makes me think about my girl, Coco McQueen. Hey girl, if you're watching, she um, has been doing more like day trips. And the only reason why I'm thinking like, I don't know if that'll work for me I'm somebody who be wanting to change my outfit. <laughs> so like, trying to do the day trips, but then like not really having a hotel to go to. Like I know there are hotels now that you could do like day passes at, so maybe, maybe it could work. But if I do, baby, I still gotta bring a carry on. For this trip, we brought literally my carry-on because i am not packing anything look luxurious in my check bag so all of my makeup bags shoes baby that stuff is in my carry-on so i got my carry-on and then me and my husband just took our smaller like a smaller loop suitcase as mine and put both our stuff in there um and i didn't even bring my lb on the go this time because i was just like i don't even want to deal with all that i'm really not trying to pack you know so heavy um because we're literally i mean for two full days here i feel like really all you need is outfit for the day outfit for the night and that's pretty much what i brought with i think i brought like one alternate for my husband i bought exactly enough outfits <laughs> so if he changed his mind about something he in trouble um but i did bring an alternate but typically i don't know for men that don't really happen for them like uh, you know it's more so us to be like i got this outfit but now i want to wear something else men don't really be going through that same thing that we go through because i'm definitely that person the outfit i'm wearing tonight was something i was considering wearing like tomorrow during the day so just goes to show you you gotta have a couple alternates as a woman but you don't gotta go too crazy so I'm just taking that Charlotte Tilbury powder. Y'all know I go in this powder first before I use my Laura Mercier. So this goes in and then I go back. The Laura Mercier powder, that's one of the things I bought. I bought the ultra blurring one because I wanted to see if I noticed the difference. Not sure if I'm gonna notice the difference, especially since I also use that Charlotte powder. So we'll see if I notice anything. Not like counting on it, but I can tell this one is getting low so I, w I would need to replace it anyway so even if it just works the same that's fine so, y'all i cannot understand why they would play us like this with this lighting it looks crazy it's okay don't pull through we don't pull through we got to <laughs> no choice But yeah, so just to make up normal stuff, I'm gonna grab the Sephora stuff and come back on y'all once we get further along in the process because like I said, we are not going too fancy with the look tonight. Um, but I will show y'all what I grabbed from Sephora. So I'll come back on once we get further along in the makeup process. Okay, y'all, the makeup is done, but again, it looks like crazy on this camera because of the lighting. But I wanna show y'all real quick what I got from Sephora. So I did get a NARS blush. I got the Orgasm Rush blush which i've seen a lot of people talking about this and i figured from the way it looked in the tester it definitely doesn't look like a color well it kind of looks like savage a little y'all but other than that i would say i don't have a color like this so that's why i wanted to grab that and then i grabbed the laura mercier ultra blur um this is a translucent honey the ultra blurring version so i have the regular version now in the travel size but i want to try this out before i buy the full size and then the last thing i got is the tarte xl tubing mascara apparently this is supposed to help really lengthen your lashes a girl um pointed me out to this and told me i should grab it so i didn't try it tonight i will try it tomorrow because if i don't like it i will return it while i'm here so um that is the three things that i grabbed from sephora earlier so we will see how those products work out i might try everything tomorrow um 
and just see what it gives. But I'm about to go ahead and get my hair all taken down, scrunch it out, fix it up and get my clothes on. I'm gonna let the hubby come and get himself together real quick. And then I'll try to show y'all a full look. Hopefully in the other mirror, the lighting is better. So I will come back once we are all fully ready to go. Okay y'all, I'm dressed, I'm ready. About to make us a little shot real quick, but I wanted to tell y'all what I just put on. It smells so good. Um, it's the Forever Mood. I am her. Um, it's a little travel size one, and then I put on the Valentino. I believe this is the Intense. Yep, the Valentino Born and Roma Donna Roma Intense, whichever one. It smells really good so far together. So I think we're gonna see how that lasts for the evening, but um, it does smell good. And then I have these leftover shot bottles. I remember I had some extras left um, from Panama that we didn't use. So I figure let's bring them here so we can just pre-game a little in our room. Unfortunately, we don't have any chaser. Oh, we could, babe, make that, um, put one of those packets in the water bottle or do you want to just take it straight? Like, are, you know what I mean? Like, do you want to have something to chase behind it? If not, okay. Since he said no chaser, y'all, I'm gonna give him the fuller shot. Cause baby, I can't do it. So, we're about to take the little shot. Um, in this lighting, you still can't really see the makeup. I will try to go in front of the mirror to show y'all my hair. But again, we're going tomorrow for dinner. Um, we're probably gonna walk around and do some other stuff this tonight. Um, but we'll see because we are tired. We got it really early today. So, we'll see what you know our bodies allow for but other than that i'm gonna take our shots and head downstairs for our uber so i will see y'all when we get tomorrow show y'all my outfit really quick the top that i've worn a million of teen time and videos these new shorts i did get these from target like almost a month ago they were on clearance i bought them just not getting to wear them my dad's sandals i'm wearing my kate why well, sell kate bag today because i do want to be able to have a crossbody we're going to be out for a while wear my burberry sunglasses so i can wear these indoor and outdoor um and yeah that's my look so let's go ahead and head out for the day You got a two-day trial before I take back my time and make you pay. Thirty-day trial before I made my mind and it it's so always yeah. Trials and tribulations. Uh -huh. Child, child, child. Kissing in Paris, I guess we could do it in French. Wow. Eating low main is child for now. Child, child. Hey, look at you. Look handsome, <laughs> what?
So y'all, we're about to walk to Willie's Chicken Shack to grab some dinner. Um, we're tired and we just want to relax in our room tonight. Y'all, we go back home tomorrow. So our trip is almost coming to an end, but we done had a good time, right, baby? Uh, yep. <laughs> we done had a good time, so we good. But we about to walk, get some food, come back to our room. I might check in with y'all once we get in. Because I want to see how this is. I ain't never had this. Out of all the times I've been in New Orleans, I've never had it. So we're going to see what it's talking about. So don't kill me y'all, but we did not record any of our food. I kind of just forgot when we got back to the room, but it was really, really good. We had such a great time in New Orleans. Thank you so much for watching.